Wiktifia Leip, Coil Mercia, Don Dove here, playing Detroit Become Human. Uh, do you want to go to the extras? Because I'm curious what that this is. This is the extras section. As you play, you'll unlock all kinds of content that you can find here. Okay. Short movie Kara. Debut teasers. Discovering Troy. There's, there's locked stuff. Okay. Soundtrack. Soundtrack. Gallery. Oh god. Oh. There's a hundred and there's a hundred and eleven people. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Magazines. Yeah, I'll click with this. Wow, okay. Survey. Great. Let's start. Ah, uh, wait. Would you consider having a relationship with an android that looks like a human? Um sure, why not? Do you think that technology could become a threat to mankind? Um, <laughs> I didn't think I'd be doing an actual survey. Um, that's the thing. Mankind is humanity of flesh and blood. Technology will at some point integrate with humanity to make a new species. So yes, and it would destroy humanity and create something new. Uh, though I don't know how we'd be able to keep the race going with technology. I think yes. If you had to live on a deserted island and could only bring one object, what would it be? Okay. Don't have electricity. Pen and paper. I, oh, I have to live on it. Um, well, if I wasn't diabetic and it wouldn't, <laughs> cause I would die on a deserted island without medical attention. Um, so entertainment basically. Probably an instrument. Cause a book will only last so long. An instrument is up to my imagination. That is worthless and that's pretty much worthless. And pen and paper. That's one piece of paper. So an instrument. Do you consider yourself dependent on technology? <laughs> As I look around and I'm surrounded by it, mm, yeah. What technology do you most anticipate? Anticipate. Brain connected devices. Um, okay, so yeah, it's between flying cars, androids, and brain connected devices because space tourism is way too far. We still haven't been able to get like normal people to be able to survive well to be able to withstand a trauma like that flying cars that's pretty far off androids eh, they sort of have androids brain connected devices they could have something like that but I do want that something that could connect your brain do you believe in God <laughs> Just go right out, don't you? Okay, sure. No. Would you let an android take care of your children? Sure. I would never have children, so, but yeah. How much time per day would you say you spend on an electronic device? <laughs> okay. Well, okay, a day. So, average is about three hours. Or three to four, and then the days that I'm off, so per day, so divided by seven. Uh, wait, times. I don't know. That's that's math. I'm gonna say four. If you needed emergency surgery, would you agree to be operated on by a machine? I don't know if they have a machine operation thing. I'm not sure because. Yes, the machine would be more precise, but if something different was to happen that was unknown variable, 
only a human would be able to compensate and, and be able to change. The machine may not have that ability unless it's already happened to someone else. It, it's just like a risk take. I don't know. Do you think one day machines could develop consciousness? Much like us, yes. Many people said yes. Wow. <laughs> Everyone wants to fuck a robot. <laughs> uh, third to mankind, yes. Of course, people. Desert Island. Yes, instrument. There's at least at least humanity is smart. Independent, yes. Do you most anticipate androids in the game, of course. And then brain connect devices, not far off. Space tourism. Apparently people want to go to space. Do you believe in God? <laughs> oh god. There's there's more no than yes. Oh man, I well I guess people who play this tend to not be God believing people as much anyway. Cause it is like certain type of people would be attracted to a game like this. <clears throat> wow. Yes, people would I'm pretty much with anyone else. Sixty five percent per se more. It's just, I'm not sure about exactly how much time, but I do know it's a lot. And we're going to see what you... Oh, machine. Yes, everyone says yes. I was not sure because of complications. Could develop consciousness. Of course, everyone's like, yes. I pretty much fell in with everyone else. Well, that's cool. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's continue. Uh, we were Kara, I believe. And uh, needed to talk to Alice. I do not know if it saved that part, so I'm about to find out. Mmm, delicious water. Oh man. Would definitely love to have a way to put, I guess, my brain into an entire body that was android like. That would just keep the brain alive since that's all the rest of my body does anyway. And, uh, just, I don't know, so have some way of keeping your brain from deteriorating through time and age. That would be awesome. Of course, that's not going to happen, at least in my time, but... Oh, man. Think of all the great things that could happen. Oh. Oh. Oh, hey. Oh. Okay. That's it. I guess it did save. Watch it. Clean restroom. Wait. The optional is clean restroom. I'm always going to do the optional. No, come on. There we go. Maybe he left something in here. Oh, okay. Damn, that was quick. Sweet. Alice. Hey, what's up? Don't be afraid. Kill. Kill. No. <laughs> wait, wait. Hold on. Alice in Wonderland. Of course. Yes. I will earn your trust. Anything else I'm missing before I talk to her? Okay. Ah. Uh, Friendly. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. Maybe we can be friends again. Yes. Yes. Uh. You're very quiet. I hope I don't scare you. What about your mother? Will she be home soon? Oh, damn it. I knew that. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, 
your favorite foods. That would really help me. Yay. What'd she give me? Oh, a key. Oh, path unlocked. Okay, so mom asked how for new instructions. Okay, so the, the mom thing was bad. <clears throat> Dang, did not mean to do that. What's in the box? Oh, shit. Four leaf clover. Oh wow. I like the real fam the real look of the family. Wait, someone's crying. That's oh, the guy and her. Angry at her. Oh. Um. Then she got dismantled. Put it out of the way. Okay. Great, now it's awkward. Ask Todd for new instructions. Um, hey Todd, don't kill me, please. So there's two bathrooms? I cleaned one bathroom at the... Okay. Oh, jeez. What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. I know what you're thinking. You think your dad's a low life. Huh? Apparently. A fucking loser. Can't get a job. Take care of his family. Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. What? You hate me. Why is he. You hate me, don't you? Say it! Why are you. You so... hate me! Why is he freaking out? What am I doing? I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? You You're know like, I love you. Don't send mixed messages. Don't send mixed messages like that. That is so... Oh my god. Secrets. Who? Wow, okay, so I missed one thing, but I did pretty good. I've learned as much stuff as I could. Yes. Okay, where are we now? So, same day. A little bit later in the day, I believe. Oh, hey, delivery boy. I don't remember your name. Oh wow, you're a delivery boy for someone who has money. Marcus. Okay. Deposit package. Why do you look... You look anxious. Why did I... What? Um... What? Okay. Andro... And... Androdic birds! 
Okay. What's that? Oh. That's, oh, yeah, yeah. Deposit package. Sorry. Wow. Okay. put down that thank you okay that's uh, a little weird take care of Carl walk upstairs oh that wasn't closed before oh it auto opens oh it auto opens I'm taking care of someone. Okay, so I, I guess I might as well get this stuff ready before I wake him up. Okay, so I'm a, a little bit of everything. I'm an every robot. Still haven't waking him up, but that's good. I'll have everything ready for him when he gets here. This is very nice. Aha! Another book. And next, I got stuff to read later. Life found on Titan. Oh, oh, Titan! I know about that. Okay, that's cool. That's, that, that's a good read. Oh, no, no, no. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to look. Checkmate in three moves for silver. Huh. <laughs> In. Why? <laughs> Why? Why? Oh god. Try. That's all. Damn, this place is fancy. Books? Why? Why would I be interested in books? Doesn't make sense. Okay, I need to go. I need to start, stop faffing about. Oh, he's an artist. Oh, that's right, he wanted paints. Okay. I don't know if I should wake him up first. I'm cleaning up. Color since 1909. Anything outside? No, but it is pretty. Oh god, oh god, oh god! <laughs> Malfunction! <laughs> okay, let's go wake Carl up. Oh god, please be a good person. Please don't be a robotic hater, hating douchebag. Carl, it's time to wake up. You've got a bright morning ahead of you, and I've brought you your paint. And you are crippled, because that's the only reason that's there. Huh. 
Yeah, I know that's the door, but what's over here? Nope. Damn. And I can't run. No! The long walk, because I'm just curious if there's anything to be seen. Oh, there's Carl. Murder! 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 Can you hear me walking in your room? That should wake you up. <laughs> Draw curtains. Oh, it's an old dude. Oh. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. 10 a.m. is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80% oh. humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. <laughs> Aww. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. You're so nice. Yay. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. No. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. Medicine. They break down so quickly. It keeps All you this alive. effort to keep them going. Hey, what happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Just some demonstrators in the street, Carl. What a bunch of idiots. They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids? I hope they didn't harm you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. I'm fine. Okay. I'll take you to the bathroom now. Oh. Oh. Oh, man, this poor dude. Oh. Oh, oh, I have to keep holding it. Or I'll drop him. Okay. I, I bathed the dude. Okay. Don't worry, old man, I will not drop you. You're actually nice to robots. You must survive. It's like the Hugh Hefner of robots. Take okay, crawl to dining table. I've already got your food set up. See, I'm what a good is robot. Special on the agenda today. Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Any news from Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, don't bother. Oh, man. Leo's your son? Or somebody else? Hey, I turned the birds on for you. Do you like that? I made it very pleasant. Starbuck. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. Yes, I've already prepared it. Oh yeah, I'm such a good robot. There you go. Voila. I did not freshly bake that. I don't. I don't know. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Hmm? Okay, Carl. Find something to do.
Wait, what? Play chess. Oh, play piano. Play piano. Television off. Mankind is so depressing. Nothing but greed, stupidity, and violence. Yep. 5,000 years of civilization just to get to where we are. That's how we survive. Play piano. Come on. No. Play piano. That will help lighten the mood. Especially since he's turned the TV off. Hopeful. Oh, there we go. There we go. We will do it. We shall survive as humanity and androids together. Yes. Oh, it's so hopeful. Don't give up, old man. Oh god, my hand. Switch hands. I didn't think this would be long. Yes! Woo! That's how we do it. Something has changed in the way you play. Sometimes I think you have more humanity than most humans. Yes. Thank you. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself. And make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Yay. Oh, that's so cool. Yay. I'm so glad I picked piano. I fucking knew it. So I guess I missed out on the chess and whatever possibly could have done uh, possibly anything else okay so that's fine I guess if I wanted to do that I could do it in other places but okay oh oh what the now this is special oh Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. Oh, this is so cool. Wow. But what's it supposed to be? Oh, it's a person. Oh, he took it off his wheels. Oh, he's just a chair now. Yes. That is so cool. <laughs> that magic paintbrush applying paint, not even <laughs> touching it. What are you drawing, sir? Or painting? What artist artistry? Don't stop watching. There's nothing else to do. Oh, there you go. <clears throat> so, 
What's your verdict, Marcus? I like it. Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. Something I can't quite define. Uh -huh. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. <laughs> Let's see if you have any talent. Wait, what? Give it a try. Try oh. painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. <gasps> Give it a try. Oh, yes. I will do my best. I hope to become the master or the apprentice or whatever. <laughs> Find a subject to paint. Why would I want to paint the desk? I guess I'll do statue. Wait. I don't want to take his. Oops. Hitting the mic. D I'm already done? Oh, pfft. That Damn. That is a perfect copy. Reality. The painting is not about replicating uh, the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. I should have done his Carl, painting. Oh, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Okay. So you get a second chance. Can I pick some crazy Do stuff? For me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. An angel. Now concentrate <laughs> on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Identity. 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 Doubts. Okay. Um, I didn't really want that, but that works. movements of the touchpad I am not so good at. Is this your son? Hey, Dad. Leo. Hey. What's up, Leo? You look I fucked up. I you come in. Oh, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen. Uh, I need yep. some cash, Dad. Of course okay. you do. What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. Wow. The answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Uh-oh. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd rather... You'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's what's it got that I don't? Smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? 
But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough! You're on drugs, enough. dude. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You're you just, never loved me. You're just strung out. You don't need a son like that. Are you feeling okay? Oh god, I can't move. <laughs> no! You better not have a heart attack because of that encounter. The painter. Okay, so... Ah. Okay, so, yeah, of course I didn't get those. That makes sense. I played piano. And I could have played chess and something else. That is cool. So, let's see. I'm actually curious. Not everyone... Oh, yeah, I read the magazines. Only 44% of people did the piano, so... Huh. Hopeful, of course. Copy the statue. Yeah, because the desk and then Carl's painting the least. Paint from the heart. Identity. Damn, should have picked a humanity or something. Oh, well. And then, duh. R really? I picked everything that everyone else was. God damn it. <laughs> Whatever. I'm just picking what everyone else picks. Let's, let's do this. Um, later that day in the afternoon. Okay. Wait, what? Um. Detective? Uh, you got shot. No androids allowed. Okay. I'm disobeying the rules. That's a police officer. Um... Business owner, criminal record, none. Come on. Edward Dempsey, administrator, criminal record, none. You wanna go? No, I'm just trying to read that. Security guard, criminal record, none, okay. Who are you, dude? Christopher Gray, unemployed criminal record DUI. How about you? Joe Han Graham, unemployed criminal record done. Asian. <laughs> Kim Yohan, delivery driver, currently unemployed, domestic abuse. How are you alive? Can't go in there. What about this? Huh. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. I got you. Samuel McRae, Docker, criminal record done. No. Yeah, yeah, please. Oh, God. Yeah, I know. That was my bad. I did not mean to do that. Dennis Ward, nar narcotics supplier? Okay. 
I'm pretty sure it's the guy who's looking down and I can't see him. Okay, so yeah, you've, he's gotta be this dude. Yeah, it's, it's gotta be you. Yeah, there you are, Hank. Hey, that looks like the guy from one of the shows I've seen. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I, I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. Threaten. Lieutenant Anderson, I must inform you that I intend to file a report on your behavior. Oh god. Nope, that was wrong. Fine. You know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender? The same again, please. See that gym wonders of technology. Yes. Make it a double. Yes! I'm smart. I know how rough guys like you work. Now that I know that you're a person I need to make happy. I'm gonna suck your fucking dick, dude. <laughs> I hope you're ready. Did you say homicide? <laughs> yes! Aw, oh, sweetness! <laughs> I did it. Okay. Kind of made him not as happy, but at least I gave him the drink. What music is he playing? You wait here. We'll do well. My instructions are to accompany you to the crime scene, Lieutenant. Listen, I don't give a fuck about your instructions. I told you to wait here, so you shut the fuck up and you wait here. Damn. Okay. Selecting priority. They told me to wait. Josh Douglas from Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Dang it. I guess I'm going. Say anything? Ugh, he's gonna be angry, but whatever. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Evening, Hank. We were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that oh, was wow. a plan till this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. Peter Connor on the landmark. The lieutenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. That's when he found the body. Okay. It was even worse before we opened the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated. This is a briefing. Review evidence. 
and something else. So while they're talking, I can sneak around and get some stuff. Assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. Stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Well, stay easy. In. Wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Oh, hey. More of that. And I didn't touch. Go wait until morning. I'm a good robot. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break in? The fingerprints, android involvement. Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the Oh wow. So eating that lets me know what it is. Just reported up. Carlos. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. And there's more Carlos blood. Anything I missed back there? No. Okay. I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. Oh, damn. I'll be outside if you need me. He told me not to touch. Uh... Hopefully I can get this done without him noticing. Of writing. What? Okay. That must be the guy who died. Chris, is this written in the victim's blood? Okay. Is your android spying on you? Wow. I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. There's one of the knives. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. Oh, jeez, there's so much to collect. And fingerprints. Carlos tried to defend himself. Deviant took an eye. Emotional shock. Wait. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. So he was attacked? Consider it done, Lieutenant. So much rain. Ah, oh, footprints. He ran this way less than 60 minutes ago. The door was locked from the inside. Killer must have gone out this way. There are no footprints apart from Officer Collins' size 10 shoes. Well, this happened weeks ago. The tracks could have faded. Oh, now, weeks? This type of soil would retain a trace. Nobody's been out here for a long time. 
TV and didn't escape this way. What? The window, right? Unless the deviant's still here. Yeah, that's it. Examine victim. Okay, am I missing something? Missing an evidence somewhere. I hope it's I hope it's this dude. Okay, this is Carlos, right? Twenty eight stab wounds deceased more than nineteen days ago. Red ice. He's deceased. Aha. Uh -huh. Yep, that's Carlos. Stabbed. They came from the kitchen. Oh, wow. He was stabbed 28 times. Yeah. <clears throat> Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Damn. I have two minutes left before it's. before I'm done. That's all the evidence. Okay, I guess I talked to this guy. I only have a minute though. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh yeah? Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started... In the, in kitchen. the kitchen. Yeah. There are obvious signs of a struggle. The question is... What exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with, with the, the bat. bat. Yeah. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Oh god. I have to remember this shit. Oh god. I hope I don't fuck up. I'm a good detective. The android stabbed the victim. Yeah, he grabbed the, the knife in defense. Was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to the living room. The living room. Yeah. Tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. Huh? The yeah. android murdered the victim with the knife. Oh well, yeah. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous, but it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Of course. Oh. But I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's happy. 
Ah, but with that, I gotta go ahead and go. Um, if you guys enjoyed, <laughs> be sure to leave likes, comments, all the good stuff. Now we'll see you guys next time. Bye.